So can we find a way? That's gonna be our mindset. This is our squad. This time, tomorrow, probably in this heat, we need to be ready. We need to be hydrated. Hydrating for the game tomorrow starts now. Remember that we are what we, we repeatedly do. So excellence is a habit, okay? Let's always practice with excellence. Communicate, communicate, communicate. Half of you on this set of dashes, right here, all the balls on one of the two sides, I don't care which one, go. I'm Gerilyn Newton. I run the girls soccer program at Portola High School. I've been here for six years now. I've been here since the school has opened. So this will be my sixth year coaching. And as well as coaching, I teach science on campus. Sloan D. Torres, she has been an incredible athlete for our program. Uh, something that really stands out about Sloan is that her skill has increased tremendously since she came as a freshman, whereas normally at this age we get a lot of athletes that have skill, but we don't really see them grow much. They've kind of plateaued where they're at, and she's someone that every single year is better and better, and she is truly our utility player. She, We can put in any position at any time in any situation, and she'll perform so we can rely on her for that. That I bring sort of a unique energy I guess. Um, I like momentum and playing fast and playing um, I guess like I want to make fun beautiful plays with my team. Jenna Verplank she's a freshman this year and she's already really made quite a, a impact to our program. Uh, she's very hardworking and she has she has skill. She plays more central kind of offensive position and um, for her size it's really incredible watching her play. It's uh, It looks so easy. She makes beating athletes, shooting, taking on athletes look like a piece of cake. She's just very skilled and uh, we're very excited to welcome her into the program. I think I bring like good communication and knowledge of the game that I've developed over the years and I think it's just really fun to play with the older and more experienced players who can just like help guide me but I think we play well together. Celine Aoki, uh, she is an incredible athlete, but she has not only made an impact with her skill, uh, but just her personality. She is a leader. She's somebody that the athletes look to as just being true inspiration. Um, she's somebody who's been actually awarded our most inspirational uh, award the last couple of seasons and um, she makes an impact and she actually was injured last season and she still won most inspirational and so I think that really says something about her character um, and of course she she hangs well in the game as well. It feels really good to be back on the field. Last year was really hard to just be on the sideline. Of course I did love cheering on my teammates um, through kind of the craziness of last season but being able to be back on the field and being playing with them, especially for my last year, has been a really good experience and I'm excited for the season. Mia Linville is a junior this year. She um, is our goalkeeper and somebody who has also really changed the dynamic of our team. Um, they've really stepped up as a leader and to have a goalkeeper like Mia who is vocal and who leads the team is absolutely contagious. And it gets our defense going, which gets our midfield going, and then gets our forwards uh, moving as well. So uh, Mia has absolutely changed our team in a lot of ways with her leadership, her skill, of course, and, uh, and just her personality. Ooh, Mia! I think I try and just get to know everybody. I become friends with all of them because they're all my teammates and they're all important to me. And I know that each of them have a role on the team and I like to get to know them. Emma Song, she is a junior and she has also really kind of blossomed as an athlete. And what she contributes the most to our team is her nonstop work. She constantly gives everything 110% until she is absolutely drained. She is also a really successful multi-sport athlete. So not only does she juggle soccer at the high school level, club soccer, but she's also a really 
active track and field member. Um, and her skill set and her speed that she develops in track, she actually brings to soccer as well. And that really makes her stand out. I really take pride in um, giving my full effort all the time. And I, um, I try not to stop running during games. I try to always be um, either defending, helping my team defend, or attacking. And I feel like I'm always moving. So The biggest Biggest takeaway from last season, what prevented us from going to CIF last season? Our warm up. Winning a game starts now, preparing your body starts now, and it starts with your warm up tomorrow. We need to find the balance. We want it to be fun, we want to have a good time, but we also want to win. You control your attitude, you control your effort, you control how you prepare. Okay, let's get ready for a fun season, and guess what's fun? Winning. Winning. Okay. Jaden, 